Hey guys, and welcome to the third installment of the Realistic Challenges of Hack This Site. Now, this tutorial involves cross-site scripting, or XSS, and uh, we're going to look into that here when we log onto the site. All right, so the third part of the realistic missions is uh, the peace poetry, and uh, this is a girl made a website for people to post poetry on, and um, fastest hack the website, and we have to hack it back and take it over. So let's check this out. Alright, so this is the page now. Um, now it's it's a uh, there's just text on here. We can control A, see what's going on here. Nothing, nothing that we need to be worried about at this moment. So we're gonna check the source code again. Um, go ahead and right click. Go to inspect element, HTML. Now, in the source code, we see that there's really nothing here. I mean, you can dig through this whole thing. Um, but what people fail to realize is that in HTML, you can put uh, comments. So we're going to inspect this with Firebug, actually. And I recommend getting it because of things like this. And notice there's a comment right here. And to see this, you have to have uh, in Firebug enable, go to HTML, the setting here, and go to show comments. And that is going to show you um, all the commented out sections. And at the bottom of the page here is note to the webmasters. Uh, this site has been hacked but not totally destroyed. The old website is still up. I simply copied the old index.html file and put it at, renamed it to old index.html. So now that we know that there's another file out there called old index.html, we're going to go ahead and put that in the end here. And here is the original website. Now let's peruse around the little the the original website and see how it might have gotten hacked. I can read the poetry, and there's some poetry links here that bring up um, just uh, PHP scripts of text. Now I've seen uh, I've seen people hack sites through the PHP value here. Um, that would be kind of SQL injection. Um, but if we go over to submit poetry, this is a page where you can actually submit information. And this is this is how XSS is performed or cross-site scripting. So we know that to submit, um, when we submit this, this is going to be the title of the document that we're submitting. And this is going to be the uh, information in it, and it'll be read by the server however uh, it's coded. So we can actually code an HTML in this, and we can name the document something that HTML will recognize in this. Now this is valid because we want to get this site to be the original HTML, the original uh, index.html file. So what we can do is go and view the page source, or F12, I think, on uh, most Windows machines. Go ahead and control A, or uh, copy everything. Control copy. And we're going to go submit poetry. And now the name of the poem is going to be the, the place where the file is located. Now because the website right now because the website right now um, is based a level up, we're going to have to use that code, and that is dot dot or period period. And then we can do the domain that we need, which is forward slash index dot html. And for the poem, we can add the content that we need, which uh, we just paste in what we had uh, copied earlier from the original page, and hit add poem. And congratulations, you did your XSS scripting. 